During this Modena video, we will cover the setup process for a Modena Hub Plus. Here's a short overview of the topics we'll address, including the necessary apps, first time connection and initial configuration, and where to find useful resources. Modena Hub Plus resides in the meeting space and is connected to a local display via HDMI and may also be connected to a physical network. It also has a USB 3 port to connect all in one AV devices or active USB hubs. Here's a look at what's in the box. Note that Moderna Hub Plus is supplied with everything you need to get started, including the mounting hardware. And here are the minimum specs for personal devices that can take advantage of Moderna Hub Plus's powerful BYOD capabilities. Moderna Hub Plus can operate in three different modes. Which mode you use defines the maximum number of simultaneous participants and the video frame rate and resolution available. The mode a unit uses is managed in the configuration page that we will cover later on. Before you begin configuration of Moderna Hub Plus, it may be useful to download the Moderna app. If your organization doesn't wish to use the app, Moderna can still be operated with any web browser. Now let's take a look at deploying a Moderna Hub Plus in your organization's environment. Here's how a typical deployment might look for one Moderna Hub Plus device on a corporate network. It supports a dual network. It can host its own local Wi-Fi and be part of the corporate network. The Hub Plus can also disable either the wired or wireless interfaces as needed. This allows it to operate on a single network. When it comes to connecting your device, start by connecting the wireless antennas, HDMI and network cables, and then any USB devices or a USB 3 hub, and finally connect the power cable to start up the device. When the Moderna Hub is powered up, it will show its IP address on the welcome screen. Enter this into a web browser to reach the Moderna Hub Plus and access the configuration page or to start presenting. From this screen, you can either use the Hub Plus to begin a presentation, or you can gain access to the configuration settings. To use the Moderna app, if you have it installed, click on its icon on your computer, and then the name of the room you want to use, and the play icon to start sharing your screen. Now let's take a closer look at the Moderna Hub configuration page. To log in, the default password is admin, but this can be changed. Use the navigation panel on the left to move around the various configuration screens and change settings to suit your preferences. The room screen manages how users may use and interact with the Hub Plus, including setting the password and which presentation mode the Hub operates in. The welcome screen configuration determines what users see on the room display when no one is presenting. There are many, many customization options available here. IP configuration is performed on the network tab. It is possible to select either a dynamic IP via DHCP or to use a static IP address. From here, you can also enable or disable the internal wireless network connectivity. The configuration web pages offer numerous other customization and settings options. And all of these options and others are documented in resources such as Cornerstone and our online help files, which can be found at these links. And remember, you can always reach out to us directly if you have any further questions.